Hey, 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 what's going on, good people? We are back. Okay, we are back. We're talking about, we're continuing on with this blood pressure, okay? We talked about um, exactly what blood pressure was. We talked about side effects of blood pressure medication. Um, we talked about what a normal blood pressure was, when to monitor it, right? Like, just learning all about blood pressure. Like, what is it, okay? So now we talk, let's talk about, like, some things we can do to lower the blood pressure, right? Things we can do to lower the blood pressure and some lifestyle changes that we can make to control, you know, high blood pressure, right? So what are some things we can do to lower our blood pressure? Anybody, anybody want to take a, you know, anybody, anybody that knows Coach Roll, what can we do to lower our blood pressure, okay? Eat God's food, okay? <laughs> Eat God's food, drink water, right? Move your body. Like these are things you can do to lower your blood pressure. Like these are simple things you can do to like reduce the sodium intake, okay? reduce, like, uh, eliminate processed foods, right? Um, and believe it or not, um, take, take out the sugar. Okay. Sugar ain't sweet. You all take out the sugar. I'm telling you, when you control your, your blood sugar, you control your whole life. People, a lot of people say, coach, well, I don't have diabetes. You know, um, why do I need to check my blood sugar? Because when you control your blood sugar, you control your whole life. So we will normalize your blood pressure by stabilizing your blood sugar right? Some things you can do, drink water, okay? Of course, exercise, okay? Um, reduce the sodium intake, eat more of God's food, you know, fruits, vegetables, nuts, seeds, grains, legumes, like, like eat more of God's food, right? Uh, eliminate the processed foods. These are things we can do to lower our blood pressure, point blank period, and it works, works almost instantly. Go raw, okay? Leafy greens are your friend. You're, my, that's this is what I tell my people. This is what I coach my people through every single day. Leafy greens are your friend, right? You you want to um, uh, lower that blood pressure? Eat God's food. Okay, eliminate the sodium. Eliminate the processed foods because if you buy things off the shelf, right? Uh, sodium, right? Salt is a is a, a it stabilizes the food. Okay, it's a preservative. It's going to preserve the food, right? So if you're getting things off the shelf, just know it's going to be filled with sodium. That's why you want to eat fresh food, whole food, right? Uh, no packaged things, no processed things, um, you know, things like deli meats and things like that. Um, all that's going to be filled with sodium, you know, um, microwave dinners, TV dinners, um, you know, jars of uh, pasta sauce and things like that. Anything on the shelf is going to be filled with sodium, right? And that's not going to help your, um, your blood pressure. That's only going to increase it or just, you know, keep it high. And so you want to do some things? Yep. No more processed foods. Get rid of the sugar, right? Um, eat more of God's food. Nuts, seeds, grain, legumes, fruits, vegetables, protein, right? Um, use salt-free seasonings, right? These are things you can do. There are many things like that. Mrs. Dash is many things. Like use, use herbs, fresh herbs and spices. It doesn't have to be um, sodium, right? Or you can find seasonings that uh, have a salty flavor, you know, like dill, um, you know, um, garlic powder, onion powder, um, paprika. Like these are things that have like a um like a salty taste, right? So so yeah, those are things you can experiment with. Um, so what what lifestyle changes uh can help control high blood pressure? We talked about it, exercise. Okay, here's some things: changing your diet. Okay, how about this? Um, limiting your alcoholic beverages. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lifestyle changes. Um, uh, get rid of the smoking. See, nobody thinks about these things. Nobody thinks about alcohol. Nobody thinks about smoking when it comes to high blood pressure. Yeah, these are lifestyle changes that you can make. Of course, we know exercise. Um, I talked about getting rid of the sugar, um, uh, losing some weight, right? Losing some weight. These are things you can do, right? Um, so lifestyle changes would mean uh, exercise regularly, losing some weight. Um, we talked about reducing, getting enough rest. How about that? Getting enough rest, they say seven to nine hours, okay? It's gonna um, really uh, work wonders for your blood pressure. So getting enough rest, um, drinking your water. A lot of people walking around dehydrated, right? So that's a whole lifestyle change right there, drinking water. Uh, let's see what else we talked about. Uh, uh, limiting caffeine. Yep, come on my Starbucks people, my people that need coffee every day. No, 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 we don't. That's affecting your high blood pressure. Okay, that's affecting your blood pressure. So getting rid of that stress management. You know, now I will say, I'll be the first to say, that's not the, the sole reason you got high blood pressure, okay? People say, oh, I'm living, I'm under a lot of stress. I'm not saying stress does not affect your blood pressure, but I promise you, food is the foundation. More than likely, you're dealing with this high blood pressure because what you're putting in your body, not because of, 
your stressful life, okay? Not because of your stressful life, but um, still, I know stress does affect it. Uh, it is a factor. So definitely minimize, do some things to minimize the stress in your life. Um, yeah, these are these are things we can do. So we have like medication is not necessary. Like I said before, it says medication, it is not. But if you will, you got to be willing to do the work, right? You have to be willing to make these lifestyle changes, right? You have to be willing to eat um, God's food. You have to be willing to move your body, drink water, cut out the uh, uh, excess uh, sodium, cut out the, the processed food, no more smoking, no limiting the alcoholic beverages, lose some weight, you see? Because when you start to do these things, you're eating God's food, right? And drinking your water, you're doing your nuts, your seeds, your, uh, uh, your grains, you know, your legumes, your fruits, your vegetables, your proteins. When you're doing these things with soft-free seasonings, you're going to lose the weight. You're going to lose the weight, right? So weight loss is the byproduct of these things. So if you just do the work, you'll get the results. You see, all roads lead back to God's food. Y'all understand? All roads lead back to God's food. So when you're eating God's food, you're moving your body, you're drinking your water, you're stabilizing your, uh, your blood pressure. You understand? That's how simple this is. All roads lead back to God's food. So we go here, we go out and we go here, we go here, we go here, and we end up right back here at God's food. We end up right back here. It doesn't matter where we, you can send us out anywhere. Anywhere, we're going to come right back here to God's food. All roads lead back to God's food, right? So you want to know how to normalize your blood pressure. You want to know how to lower it, normalize it, get off the medication, all these things. Eat God's food, drink your water, move your body, right? I promise you, you're going to lose the weight, right? When you get rid of this sugar you know, processed food, right? Um, alcohol, smoking. When you do these things, the, your blood pressure is just going to normalize. You're going to lose the weight. You're going to feel better. You're going to live better. Do you understand me? It's just that simple. Don't complicate this thing, you all. Don't complicate it. I've given you the answers, okay? I've given you the answers. Now go out and do the work, all right? That's all we have, guys. I hope you learned something about blood pressure. This is simple. Don't complicate this. This is simple. Keep it simple, okay? Keep it simple and get the results. That's all I have, y'all. Listen, I am Rochelle T. Parks. I am your health motivator, guys. And guess what? Whether you like it or not, I really do not care, okay? I can, I will, and I must continue to walk alongside you and help you to achieve optimal health. And I'm out. Peace. Love y'all.